Hello everybody, how are you doing? And welcome to another vlog. Today I want to discuss something that came to fruition today. An idea that kind of snowballed from me recalling the time when I used to post something really nice through people's letterboxes, just anonymously. A nice picture or a nice message. And that kind of went into the idea of maybe we should have a, a day each month where we do a random act of kindness for somebody else. It can be anonymously, it cannot be, it's totally up to you and it's totally up to you what it is. Um, and I think that I will go back to posting random nice things through people's letterboxes, like a nice message or a, a nice piece of art or something like that, you know, something that you can afford but would also brighten someone's day. And I think that's a, a fantastic idea. It was just one of those things that kind of, you know, you said something, somebody else said something, and it kind of just really snowballed into it. And then I was like, I'm going to go with this. This sounds like a great idea and everybody can do it because it's not tied to finances or time because it, it wouldn't take that much effort. Even if you just, you know, randomly complimented a stranger or, you know, just help the door open for someone who's elderly. I don't know, just anything, you know, anything. Once a month, just do it. And that way, I think we will create a more positive environment for everybody. Because sometimes, you know, people want to do these things and they find it hard to get that ball rolling. And I think that this would be a really good opportunity to kind of influence that. You know, the pay it forward system is really good and I've always believed in it. It's one of my favorite things in the world is when you do something good and then inspires that person to do something good for that person and it just goes on and on and on. And of course, it doesn't always work and that's a shame, but I see it in my own life, for example. A lot of the kindness that I receive now is because I have been kind to a lot of people as well and I give back as much as I can. And that way, you know, it's, it's, it's kind of like the, the, the balance of the karma world, I like to call it now, apparently. <laughs> so I think the day should be at the beginning of the month because the, the beginning of the month can be very hard for people when they're going through things or financially struggling or mentally or physically, anything. I know that when I'm really bad, uh, when I have stuff going on, I find it another month a challenge just thinking about having to go through another month it's like oh the same thing again the same stress about bills the same stress about you know uh trying to function and getting stuff out and getting things done and just you know all the things that you have to struggle with in life and you have to deal with in life usually the beginning of the month can be very challenging just like mondays can be very challenging because it's a new school week it's a new work week and you have to do it all again and you just want it to be the weekend it's kind of similar to months as well if you work and things like that um, the beginning of the month is like, oh, I gotta wait four weeks until I get paid again and I have to make everything work until then, you know, that kind of thing. So it can be very stressful. And I think that if we do this random act of kindness or random acts of kindness, that doesn't have to be one, you can do like four or five people or like maybe 20, um, it's up to you. And it's up to you what it is. As long as it's nice, it's positive and you think it will make someone smile. And of course, don't be creepy. <laughs> don't be creepy. <laughs> but yeah, I think the first day of every month would be a lovely time to do this, just to get people started with a smile. And um, we'll be starting this March. So the 1st of March will be the first rack day, <laughs> random act of kindness. I know I, I took it the wrong way as well when I saw rack, uh, somebody had to explain it to me. <laughs> but I think it would be a good hashtag, hashtag rack day. Um, that will be the hashtag that I'll be using on Twitter as well and please post what you've done um, either here on this video or post it on Twitter with that hashtag or if you're on Discord or you want to join on Discord, the, the link's below, um, then please let me know on Discord what you've done. It would be really good to share and to share ideas and maybe just discuss how we could make people's lives just a little bit brighter and a little bit happier, even if it's just for a day. I think that would be a great thing to do and I hope you're all on board 
let me know what you think in the comments and I'm looking forward to seeing what everybody does. So 1st of March, we start with Rack Day. Hashtag Rack Day. <laughs> R-A-K, <laughs> not R-A-C-K, please. <laughs> All right, much love to you all. I hope you all have a great weekend and I will see you later for some Subnautica. Mm -hmm.